this is beyond refreshing. A young, conservative black woman rips to shreds the fake racism gamut being pushed by the left. She's incensed over the rush to paint the entire right as the KKK, neo-Nazis and white supremacists. The media is heavily pushing this ridiculous premise. Candace Owens slams the media and how they want black people to fear white supremacists all over America. She pointed out that the overwhelming majority of black homicides are committed by black people, 93%, not roaming gangs of Klansmen. She astutely points out that black people are being racist towards themselves with crime. That is a logical conclusion. Black Lives Matter and the left are using the same twisted logic with police officers, insinuating that innocent black people are killed by them all the time, when almost all black individuals that are killed by officers are criminals who either attacked the officer or made a move that could be interpreted as an attack. Race had nothing to do with it, just as race has nothing to do with the majority of black people being murdered in the US. But you'd never know that by listening to the media who is egging on a race war for all they are worth. Not everyone is dumb enough to buy that. Let me invite you over for a cup of hot steaming facts. A conservative black woman completely trounced the leftist narrative being pushed by the media on violent rioting last weekend in Charlottesville, Virginia. White supremacy and the KKK. Really? That's what you guys want me to be concerned about this week? Candace Owens asked in a scathing rebuttal of liberal media agenda in a video published Wednesday. Do I look like an idiot? If you are a black person and you expressed some irrational fears this week over the rise of the Klansmen and neo-Nazis, let me invite you over for a cup of hot, steaming facts, Owens began as she tore into the racist narratives pushed by liberal media. Owens cited statistics showing approximately 93% of black homicides were committed by other black people while 2012 figures showed 84% of white homicides were committed by white people. Go figure. It's like we're all racist towards our own selves, she concluded. There are approximately 6,000 Klansmen in the US. I won't deny that their numbers seem to be growing. But there are 350 million people here. The irrational fear the media is ginning up is monstrous. President Trump is not pushing racism, the media is. Why did we not hear a single thing about David Duke, white supremacy and the KKK the entire time Obama was in office? Owens queried. Do you think they were all hiding underground, waiting for the next white president? Meeting by the light of the moon? Do you really actually mean they weren't still meeting, holding protests and having rallies and marches? Sure they were. And there is racism on the left against whites as well. Not to mention cop and military hatred. That is what Obama focused on. Now, it's white supremacists because that fits the left's agenda. In America, most black and white people get along just fine and race is not an issue. It's only an issue on the fringes of society, on the left and with the media. It sounds horrid because it's supposed to. They want us at each other's throats so the left can tear it all down. It's what communists do. It's what they've done throughout history. There was violence on both sides in Charlottesville. The white supremacists just beat the communists, Antifa and BLM to the punch there. Both sides are being manipulated and used. They are useful idiots. People like Candace see right through it though and aren't gullible and susceptible to the machinations of the Marxists. Get a clue people, what you saw in Charlottesville is not who we are. It's who the communists want us to be. Identity politics is killing America. What do you think about this? Let us know your thoughts in the comments section. Let's make this go viral, share this on Facebook and Twitter and let us know what else you think. And don't forget to help support us by subscribing and joining us on Patreon.
by clicking on our Patreon link in the description box down below. Don't forget to check out our all new website with much more content than on this YouTube channel. If you are seeking the best in facial and clear skin regimens and products along with skin age reversal and so much more from the makers of ProActive, including an opportunity to work from home and earn a residual income, please visit our partner, the link is in the description box below. Now, if you are ready to check out the most extreme things that you never knew existed please check out Change Tonight at www.changetonight.com. Let the world know your thoughts on this story. Right Wing News helped contribute to this report. Thanks for watching and goodbye from all of us here.